Manu Manu Angabadi Land Owner Representative Reverend John Ovia has asked the Prime Minister Peter O'Neill to honor his promise for a commission of inquiry instead of an administrative inquiry. They also questioned how all the portions of land were state land. Patient to know that what the government is doing is pulling that stress, that small stress, out like an elastic, elastic rubber, all the way to one month, which is not true. That land is not a state land. That's a customary land. The demand for the Commission of Inquiry is based on the following reasons. One, the Commission of Inquiry has legal powers to summon witness to testify and call for documents to be tendered during its proceedings. Two, the Commission of Inquiry is a public inquiry with a much wider scope, hence its proceedings will not be conducted in private, and its final report will go to the Parliament for debating and scrutiny based on its findings and recommendations. No less than uh, three kilometers by three kilometers. That's a state land. We know that. Our people know that. All of Gabari people know that. But what we are so disappointed about is the government elongating the initial state land like an elastic rubber all the way to the coastline and right out into the middle of Pacific Ocean. The leaders say they are worried that the administrative inquiry will not cover the six points recommended in their term of reference to be developed for the Commission of Inquiry that the PM promised to set up. Adelaide Sirox, Kari National, MTV News.